My name is Catherine Paradiso. I'm an adult and psychiatric nurse practitioner currently working in substance abuse treatment. Women's Health Care is the official journal of the National Association of Nurse Practitioners in Women's Health. So I was very happy when my manuscript was accepted because I know that this important information will reach the largest number of nurse practitioners caring for women. The opioid epidemic remains a significant problem in America today. Opioid use and treatment in women deserves more attention because substance abuse and response to treatment presents a different picture than in men. The impact to women has been profound. Women are prescribed opioids more frequently than men, become dependent on a smaller amount of opioids over a shorter period of time. My article, Opioid Use Disorder in Women Distinguishing Features, focuses on opioid use disorder in the context of one woman's case. It describes her story, which is similar to many women who use. Her path to addiction began when she was prescribed a short course of opioids, less than a week, for postoperative pain. She presented to rehabilitation centers seeking a legal pathway to obtain her much-needed opioid medication, but more important, seeking relief, seeking relief from her struggle to stop using. Within the paradigm of harm reduction, she has received evidence-based care, and her overall health and life is much re- much improved. As nurse practitioners, we see women in primary care and every specialty. We must be aware of the risks and red flags pointing to potential or actual substance abuse when we encounter them. And we must be familiar with harm reduction and evidence-based treatment options. I hope everyone who reads this column can better understand how to care for women with opioid use disorder. 